Proving that no good deed goes unpunished, Dennis the Hitman catches up with SpongeBob and Patrick. Not so Just fast. when it seems that they will be crushed on the foot, a giant boot crushes Dennis, saving our heroes. But it is out of the frying pan and into the fire, as this mysterious benefactor of a foot turns out to be a hideous giant cyclops. <laughs> the cyclops easily captures SpongeBob and Patrick, who heroically pass out immediately. When they regain consciousness, it doesn't take much to realize that they are in a load of trouble. Help them escape their most dangerous predicament yet. Patrick, where are we? Kansas. I don't think so. But wherever we are, we better stay. Whoa! It's the Cyclops! Maybe he wants to be friends with us. I wouldn't bet on it. You mean we're not gonna get the crown, save the town, Mr. Krabs? I don't think we're even gonna be able to save ourselves, buddy. I guess what everyone said about us is true, Patrick. You mean that we're attractive? No, that we're just kids. A couple of kids in way over their heads. We were doomed from the start. I mean, look at us. We didn't even come close to the crown. We let everybody down. We failed. Shell City. Yep. We never made it to Shell City. Shell City. Exactly, buddy. That's the place we never got to. Shell City. Okay, now you're starting to bum me out, Patrick. No, look at the sign. Shell City. Marine gifts and sundry. Shell City's a gift shop? But if this is Shell City, then where's the... Pat? Did make it. SpongeBob, buddy! Don't die! We've come so close! I've gotta find a way to bring SpongeBob back to life! He needs water, and fast! Sea urchins, and they're all dried out. It's really gross. I can't reach the bowl. I'll have to find another way to get water to SpongeBob. Cogs, just the skeletons, though. Everything in this place is dried out. I can't let that happen to my buddy SpongeBob. Or to me. It's a lunchbox. It's too heavy to move on my own. That red button looks like it does something, but I'm not strong enough to press it. Here goes nothing! Whoa! Wow! That hurt my belly! Looks like everything spilled out of the lunchbox! Onion! Well, a piece of one anyway. It's making me tear up a bit. Wow! Look at the size of this food! No water here though. Spongebob, you're alive! Oh, 
Hooray! Hooray! I'm so happy! Um, Patrick? <laughs> yes, SpongeBob? Could you stop crying all over me now? Oh, sure, buddy. It's raining! Kendrick, your tears shorted out the heating lamp and set off the sprinklers! Now's our chance to get out of here! In this weather? Let's go! I always knew it paid to be a crybaby. with a chest of iron and, and some hair, too, and he roams the beaches looking for people in trouble. We just have to find the whistle. The whistle? Yeah, the call of the... It's a chrome whistle, and when you blow it, he comes and saves you. Hooray! Sounds kind of crazy. It is! Hooray! I guess we don't have much choice. Okay, Patrick, let's find that whistle and ride that... Hooray! I'm not sure what that is, but it makes me kind of homesick. There's nothing in there. Those things should be illegal. I'd better not get too distracted. Mr. Crab's life is in my hands. It's a shell. It's kind of shovel-shaped. Doing? I'm searching for buried treasure. You'd be surprised at how much stuff people lose at the beach. No, I wouldn't. Found anything? Yeah. I spotted something a little ways over there. I marked it with an X. It's nothing valuable, though. My metal detector says it's made of chrome. I can't be bothered with anything that isn't gold. Gold, huh? Yep, gold is worth that, my man. I'll take your word for it. If you don't want that chrome thing, can I have it? Sure. All you have to do is dig it up. I marked where I saw it with an X. Thanks! What are you doing out of water? What are you doing out of water? I asked you first. I'm a mud skipper. I can go for days out of water. Can you? Nope. Well then? Well then, indeed. I'm gonna go. Happy hunting. Who knows what unspeakable horrors lurk in there? I, for one, do not intend to find out. to find a quicker way to get home than just swimming back. We never make it in time. What about the... Oh, Patrick, don't be silly. No one believes in that. I know a guy who knows a guy who knows a guy whose cousin once saw a picture of a... footprint in the sand. Really? That's enough evidence for me. How can we reach him? The call of the... The what? I have heard the call of the... It is good. Makes sense, Patrick. Well, the guy I know says you just have to call him. I wonder what his number is. Seven? Uh, well, we have to find some way to get home quickly, with or without that. It's a piece of driftwood. Seems pretty strong. Hooray! It worked! Patrick, 
It's the, 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 the call of the... No! I tell you, it's true. Blow it! Blow it! Calm down, Patrick. I will. <laughs> <laughs>